So I'll cut this out right now. Yes, so I've gone ahead to fix the dart for each of the um, part I propose to fix in that. I've joined each of them together. You can see I've, this, this is the back part of the dress. I've joined the the upper and the lower part together. I'm here to surge it. So the next thing is going to be the surging aspect. So this is the second one, as you can see. I've fixed the dart and then I've joined the two together. I've done that for the front part too. I've fixed the dart of the upper, the front part. Okay, that's the upper part. Then I've joined it to that uh, draped part of the of the dress. You can see. So can you see what I'm talking about? So the next thing to do is this uh, detail on the front part. Okay, this detail on the front part. You can please cut an interface into it so that when we are done, we have a solid structure. So I'll go ahead now and then iron this to it. If you don't have an iron, you can just sew it up and then iron it when you're done. Okay, so boy, it's better you iron it to the um, facing, to the uh, fabric rather. So you just sew and then you sew. You see, I've notched this part already. So you sew, notch it, you sew all this through and then you open this side and this side. Okay, that's where you bring it out and then you join it to the uh, front part of the dress. So I've gone ahead to turn out this uh, front part. You can see it's already looking so good. Look at the gather on that side. So it should just be placed right on on the neckline. I'll show you how to go about that. So let's set this aside. So the next thing we are supposed to do right now is to put um, our facing. Remember that we have joined the front and the back part already together. You know, so the next thing we are supposed to do is to put the facing of of each of them. We use it to turn it. The other one we did the last time. Remember that we we joined the three, um, the facings together first before we started joining the shoulders together. But in this case, it will be a little different. We are going to be joining each of the facing to each of the shoulders, okay? Because of the style, so we'll go ahead and join. Sorry, I use this uh, facing to turn. We use it to turn the main fabric. We'll do that for the front part. And we'll do that for the back part of the uh, gown. And then we'll notch it. After which, I'll just fold this one half of an inch. Sorry, quarter of an inch. You can decide to size it, but I'll be folding it by quarter of an inch. So it should look this way when we are done. I'll come back and show us after we are done. So right now, I've gone ahead to... To turn the neckline look at what i'm trying to tell you so i've turned the neckline just like this <laughs> i mean i'm just so glad of the way but what i'm seeing right now look at it just have a look before we actually finish and complete it so we have something like this on that side okay so let's set this aside i told us that we're going to uh, fix the facing for the other one but i think it's better that we just fix the zip first so that it will be neatly finished so i just went ahead to join from where the zipper is starting from i used the measurement of the zipper first so i did this from where the zipper is starting from just like this i'm going to leave around the 0 0.7 inches upwards to sew so look at so i started my zipper from this side so I held it down. I left around the uh, eight inches from the from the lower part. I left around eight inches, okay. So I went ahead to to sew. I sewed to this point. So the next thing I'm going to do is to open it up like this. The back part before I serge anything. So I'll just fold it into two like this, like this. Please watch me closely. So I'll go ahead and fold it this way. So, like that, down to this point, then I'll just sew like this and this way, and then I'll fold this one too like this, and I'll sew down. So, you can decide to use your two needle to stitch over it, or you can just give just one stitch around it, just to make it uh, look ready to wear, alright? Okay, so I'll go ahead and fix my zip and come back and show us what it looks like. So right now 